Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. The United States maintains a leading edge in almost every field of science and technology, and Huawei will inevitably form a competitive relationship with American high-tech companies when it accelerates technological development. If Huawei is an ordinary company, it will naturally not attract the attention of the United States. The key is that Huawei's development is too fast, which makes the United States feel anxious. So it launched a series of restrictive measures against Huawei. However, the restrictions did not stop Huawei. On the contrary, it accelerated technological innovation and made major breakthroughs in operating systems, AI, databases, and other fields, forming a stronger benchmarking competitive advantage with US companies. Some foreign media said that the Huawei incident was completely blown up. Huawei has suffered a total of four rounds of US sanctions. From operating systems to chips, to 5G communication equipment, and various hardware and software technical facilities, almost all of them have received special care from the United States. The United States does not allow Huawei to obtain advanced technical support. Even if Qualcomm is allowed to ship chips to Huawei, they are only 4G chips. After so many years, Huawei has turned the corner and found a way to develop and move forward under pressure. The four rounds of US rules and sanctions did not make Huawei fall, but instead aroused Huawei's determination to conduct comprehensive self-research, and its annual R&D investment is breaking new records. However, Huawei's contribution and return are directly proportional. It has made major breakthroughs in the fields of operating system, AI, chips, and databases, and has formed a stronger competitive advantage in benchmarking with US companies. Let China first look at Huawei's operating system. The operating system industry in the United States is very powerful. Many well-known operating systems such as Windows, iOS and Android are developed by companies from the United States. These operating systems are widely used on PCs, smartphones, tablets, and other devices worldwide. Before being cut off by the United States, Huawei was also a member of the Android operating system. After being cut off from Google's GMS service, Huawei launched the Hongmeng operating system. The system adopts a distributed architecture design and can be used on devices such as mobile phones, computers, and smart cars. Up to now, Hongmeng has occupied 8% of the market share in China. Nearly a hundred models have been upgraded to Hongmeng 3.0 and the 4.0 beta system has also been pushed on the Mate 50 series mobile phones. Hongmeng has firmly secured the throne of the world's third largest operating system, and its rise is unstoppable. Let China look at Huawei's AI technology again. The United States has the world's leading strength in AI technology, and Opnu AI is once again leading the American AI technology revolution. The company's chat GPT, Generative Artificial Intelligence, has become popular all over the world, and domestic and foreign manufacturers are stepping up to launch large-scale models, but Huawei has already made plans. Huawei has its own Pangu model. According to Hu Hokuan, the rotating chairman of Huawei, the Pangu Model 3.0 will be officially launched on July 7th. 
It can be seen from the official website of Huawei Cloud that the Pangu Large Model has multiple large models, including NLP Large Model, CV Large Model, Multimodal Large Model, etc., and has strong content generation, detection, and cross-modal generation capabilities. Huawei's launch of the Pangu Model 3.0 is of great significance. With the application and promotion of the Pangu model, Huawei will enhance its technical strength and competitiveness in the field of artificial intelligence and promote the development of the industry. In order to restrict the development of artificial intelligence in China, the United States does not allow NVIDIA and AMD to ship high-end GPU chips just to prevent China from using them to train large models. But even without the support of American technology, China's development in the artificial intelligence industry cannot be prevented. With domestic manufacturers like Huawei, they will definitely be able to create an era of artificial intelligence that belongs to China. And database technology. The database is the core of enterprise data management. It can store, organize, and manage the key data of the enterprise. Most of the domestic databases are provided by Oracle Corporation of the United States. If you rely on American technology for a long time, it is easy to get stuck. Huawei has also deeply cultivated the core technology of the database and brought the distributed database GaussDB. This is the first database product with software and hardware synergy in China. It has the characteristics of high performance, high reliability, and scalability. GaussDB can be widely used in cloud computing, big data analysis, Internet of Things, and artificial intelligence. For China, the GaussDB database is of great significance. It provides an independent and controllable database solution, which reduces the dependence on foreign database manufacturers and improves the protection of national information security and data sovereignty. The independent research and development of GaussDB also reflects China's technical strength and innovation capabilities in the database field. Through independent research and development and promotion and application, China's influence and market share in the database field can be enhanced, and the competitiveness of Chinese enterprises in the international market can be enhanced. Some foreign media said, the Huawei incident was completely blown up. Under the US restrictive rules, Huawei has overcome a series of bottleneck technologies encountered by Huawei one by one. If this trend continues, Huawei's self-developed software and hardware technology products will help China's technology continue to develop and American companies will gradually win the market in the future. U.S. restrictions will not stop Huawei, but will only make it stronger. If you agree with the point of view of this video, please like it, welcome to forward, leave a message and share.